we sometimes try and simplify things and say, well, look, at there's cholesterol plaque that builds up in the arteries. It must be diet, exercise, high blood pressure, all these classic risk factors. But we, we, interestingly, when we've done some uh, classic studies to look at um, correlation of uh, gum disease and heart disease, there is a higher incidence. And uh, years ago, we were doing, when we were actually fixing some of the arteries by removing some of the plaque, we actually stained the plaques for various types of organisms and it was found that certain types of bacteria and, and signs of bacteria were in the, in the plaque and these were bacteria that were commonly found in, in uh, decaying teeth, teeth and um, people that have gum disease. So that's where this correlation, that's where we think that maybe that it's not that simple and that people that have uh, chronic infection or problems in their teeth send off, have certain uh, mild bacterial infections or other responses that gets into the plaque and maybe cause the plaque in the coronary arteries to change and uh, increase the risk of uh, coronary problems and narrowing of the arteries and subsequent heart attacks. I think in, in medicine as in life, we're trying to simplify things too much. And there's a really a, a, a probably a more complex interaction between many body processes going on and, and say heart problems. So the fact that there is this correlation between gum disease and the heart, that maybe that, that, that similarly by, by uh, having good dental hygiene, having uh, being generally lean and fit, uh, making sure that you don't have kidney, fit, kidney problems and other things can all affect the heart because all these uh, processes in the body are, are interchangeable and, inter and interact together such that I think that the healthier we are, whether it be gum disease, making sure our, uh, our, our renal liver processes are doing well, that we're not overdoing it in any other way or stressing our bodies is going to have a positive effect on the incidence of heart problems.